Hi, this is Mike from Minimal 3D Pay. And today I'm gonna to show you how to get a icon to display on your big tree tech screens for your printers. Um, in the past listed above, I have a video on how to update the firmware on your screens. And like I said, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to get the icon for the slice model if you're using Cura. So let's go ahead and get started. So the first step you wanna take is navigate over to the Big Tree Tech GitHub page and go to their touchscreen firmware. Now I'd recommend going ahead and updating your firmware to the latest version. They have a latest version here, but if you go ahead and it looks like they've updated the binaries, but not done a release in over a year, but the binaries are, are up to date. So I'd update from those binaries and they were updated as of this video three days ago. So you wanna scroll down here and down towards the bottom, they have the steps to get the icons to display. I'm gonna keep scrolling. And I should have just looked at the links, but that would have been the smart thing. Now they say you can get this to work with Prusa Slicer. I've not had any luck with it. So, but I have had luck with getting the uh, Cura version to work. So what you wanna do is go ahead and open up this page here for the plugin. And what this is, is this is a plugin for Cura to display big tree tech icons. They do it in their own format. I'm going to point out a couple of things. One, if you're using Cura 5, you're going to have to download a different zip file. If you're using Cura 4 or less than Cura 5, I guess, so which Cura 4 in some version, you can just download this zip file here. You're using Cura 5, which I am. We're going to go up here to Issues and Cura 5.0 under Issues. And somebody has pre-compiled a version. So if you look for, um, I guess, the site, this comment from June 9th, 2022, you can download the zip file. So I'm going to go ahead and download it. And then once I have it downloaded, click download here. I'll show you how to get that installed. So I've gone ahead and opened my downloads folder in File Explorer, and I'm just going to show you a couple different things here. Cura 5.0 version is Big Tree Tech 3D plugin. And then this Big Tree Tech 3D plugin suite Bash Master is the version fuel uh Cure version four. So let's just look at both those folders real quick. And you'll notice both of them have, you'll notice the version four has three, th these three folders. And then if we go over to version five right here, it has the same three folders. So depending on what version of Cure you're doing, you're gonna go into the correct zip file and copy the reason these three folders. You only need these folders. So I'm just going to copy those. And then I'm going to go ahead over to Cura. Okay. So now I'm in Cura. And the easiest way to do this, I'm using Cura in Windows. But if you're using Cura in Linux or Mac, the same process should work for you. You're going to go to Help and Show Configuration Folder. And so that brings up my configuration folder here. So you should see that on your screen. I'm gonna go ahead and look for plugins, and then I'm going to right click and paste those three folders. In my case, they're already there, and I'll just go ahead and replace destination files. So that's it. Now, what I would do is close Cura, and we're gonna go ahead and reopen it. So I've gone ahead and opened Cura back up, and I've added a Benchy. I'm gonna go over here, just change a setting to go ahead and hit slice. And once I've sliced it, I'm going to go over here to the save menu and hit the arrow and I'm going to change it to save as big tree 3D format. Then I'm just going to hit the button to save it. And I'm going to go ahead and save this to my SD card. Let it go ahead and save and it might take a little bit longer I noticed. But now it's finished. And I'll take you over to my printer and show you a couple of settings over there. So I'm over here at my TFT. And 
go ahead, insert my SD card. Now, here's the icons only work if you use the SD card from the TFT, not the onboard card. Or change anything, just go to menu, and go to settings, and screen. Then I need to go over here to UI, and I need to files view or list mode is turned off. That setting has to be turned off in order for the icons to display. That's turned off. And if I go over here and print and select my TFT, there's the icon invention. So that's the process. Get the uh, icons from your slicer from Cura to display on your big tree pack screen. Hope that, I hope that helps you. As always, if you have any questions, please go ahead and post them in the comments. I'll also post some links. Hopefully you found this helpful. Again, I appreciate your time. And if you have any ideas or videos you'd like to see, please just let me know. Thank you again for your time. Have a good day. Bye.